Okay, so here we are, 95 GMC 3500 HD, 6.5. We've just put in a reman fuel injection pump. Um, we've had it started probably a dozen times, let it run for, I don't know, probably an hour total amongst all of them. Um, starts pretty good, but we're having a loping idle problem. So here's the data as of right now, 74 degrees. The engine hasn't been started since yesterday, probably 12 hours ago. We've got our time set and our TDC offset learned. Um, I've also moved that all over. You know, it's been from about negative 1.8, uh, negative 1.5, negative 0.7, negative 0.18, and it does the same thing each time. So I'm gonna turn the key off here. I had it on because of the computer data. Let the glow plug cycle and then we'll start it. Seems to have the rough idle, what I was noticing yesterday, only when it's warm. normal so far other than that little bit of air in the injection pump I'm gonna go ahead and let it warm up and then I'll be back so we're still warming up um, something I just noticed a moment ago it's been idling smooth like this except for two occasions here recently in the last minute or two where it noticeably almost shuts off it kind of sputters drops a couple hundred rpm then kind of catches itself it goes back to this idle i don't really know how else to describe it, it doesn't seem to be missing or anything just kind of everything drops at once maybe 500 rpms then it catches and goes back to this normal idle Still no check engine lights or anything. Everything's pretty well normal. Still idling like it was when we did the cold start. Now it has just started the lopy idle. The truck hasn't been shut off. It's been running now for, well, it hasn't been shut off. It's been running for probably 10 minutes straight. Yeah, there you go, 11 minutes straight. Still no check engine light. It's up here in the dash on this truck, right up in here. So no check engine light. the lopy idle i don't know how well you're going to be able to hear it on the video but kind of the best way to describe it it just sounds like a, a gas engine with a big can not that it's missing or anything just a lopy idle
we've been running a little longer now we're almost completely warmed up you can see it's been idling now for almost 20 minutes sounds like it's loping a little bit worse now I'm not sure if it actually is worse than before or if it's just because we're idling, idling a little bit slower now that it, it's more pronounced still no check engine light or anything it hasn't cut in and out anymore since the last video still no check engine light or anything we're completely warmed up now that's where we're at I'm gonna try and do a little bit of a driving video here so it's fairly flat where we're at here for the moment starting off in second gear so now this is third gear right here to the floor kind of hear how it's sputtering kind of leaning over That's been to the floor since I shifted into third. Going up a slight grade now. Got to stop up here at the stop sign. I'll do that again here in a second and have the data with it. All right, so we're kind of staged up for another run here. I'm on the same stretch of road, just facing the other direction. Down here in the bottom left, I've changed that to regular fuel rate. Idling fairly smooth at the moment. So we're going to start off in second again. I'm going to try and hold this on the data as we go. To the floor. Shift into third. To the floor. That's held to the floor. Kind of feeling cutting in and out. Fourth gear to the floor again. Right now we're doing 40 miles an hour. So this is just after the drive. I just got back to my shop here and parked it outside, letting it idle. Still no check engine light. Fuel rate seems really high right now. I don't not sure why that is it's got kind of a funny noise to it I'm not sure if it comes through on the video but it's just a different noise than any other 6.5 I've heard this doesn't sound as I don't know as easily I guess for lack of a better word Idling smooth for the moment. I'm going to let it idle for a few minutes here and see if it goes back to the lopey idle. So this is later after the drive. It's been sitting idling for about 18 minutes since we got back. It was idling pretty smooth until I just started this video. Now it almost sounds like it's... You heard it kind of rev up there and then back down on its own.
strange tone to it. I know the RPM there looks fairly normal, but it, it just sounds slower than earlier when it was idling at the same RPM according to this. Tack needle's about the same spot as it was. Like I said, just by ear, it just sounds slower than, than that. again here after it had been outside for probably 10 or 15 minutes shut off. Got a real rough idle. We'll straightened out some now. 